IED Scout is an ideal tool to work with IEC 61850 devices. You can discover the IED's data model by simply entering its IP address. For example, for a protection relay and a circuit breaker. Additional connection parameters can be chosen if necessary. The navigation pane shows the presently selected IED. The symbols represent the operational status. For instance, the green mark indicates that the discovered IED is online. All the information for each IED is shown in a tree-based structure, including the data model, data sets, goose messages, and reports. Concerning the data model, the navigation pane is limited to the logical node level and gives an overview of the IED and its top-level structure. The logical nodes are then shown in greater detail down to the attribute level in the details pane. IED Scout provides you with text explanations from the standard. The measured values come with the correct units for comfortable reading. With the new activity monitor, you can see all kinds of data objects or attributes with ease. For example, the voltages and currents measured by the relay, the trip signals, or the CB position can be dropped into the monitor. IED Scout starts automatically polling according to the time specified here. For commissioning, the object of interest can be zoomed in. In addition to the possibility of reading out data, you can also write data and control structures. Even complex control sequences such as select before operate can be issued, as we see with the CB position. As soon as any data attribute changes its value, an exclamation point appears next to the logical device or logical node and all the subordinated elements. IED Scout works as a client to obtain the IED's reports. They can be defined by modifying the data in the respective control blocks. Creating your own data set is quite easy with the Add Data Set option. Just drag and drop any data object or data attribute of your interest so you can receive and verify any defined report. Dragging the report control block to the activity monitor enables the report and allows you to define trigger conditions and select the associated data set. The goose messages can be subscribed, meaning that the gooses are permanently monitored and displayed in the IED's data model with their actual values. With this feature, you can check whether all gooses from an IED are received correctly or not. The goose state symbol changes when the gooses are not received or do not match the definition. Independent from the subscribe goose command, an individual goose is subscribed automatically once you drop it into the activity monitor. Keep in mind that the IED Scout can only subscribe if the send and goose functionality is enabled on the IED. Please use the Enable button in the Home tab for this purpose. In addition, the IED Scout is able to simulate a goose message using the definition from an SCL file or discovered IED in the network. Once the goose is selected, you can tune the parameters before sending it off. The new simulation indication of Edition 2 of the standard is activated by default. The data model of a selected IED can be saved to an SCL file. This function is typically used to produce an ICD or IID file for a discovered IED. The different schemes used in Edition 1 and Edition 2 can be selected. 
Similarly, an SCL file can be opened directly without the need of network access. When the file is opened, it is offline by default. This provides the means for an easy offline analysis of the SCL file. IED Scout comes with a powerful SCL parser assisting you to find issues in files. Just click the online button to establish the connection. In case you want to diagnose communication issues in the substation, the sniffing tool is the ideal solution to capture any traffic, such as goose messages and client-server communication. Remember that the messages sent between other participants in the network can only be captured with the so-called mirror ports on the switch or network tap device. The ribbit includes a series of filters to limit your search. The message window shows the filtered gooses, reports, or client-server communication found in the network. The sniffer does not only show the single packet, but also the entire communication with request and response in the details window. You can subscribe the gooses whose IED definition is unknown directly from the sniffer. They will be added to the Goose overview in the navigation pane at home. IED Scout shows the network traffic as IEC 61850 events, but not the low-level protocol details. However, it makes it easy to export the traffic to a PCAP file. Doing so, you can analyze the network traffic and have a detailed look at the lower protocol layers. It is also possible to export the captured traffic to a CSV file for documentation purposes. IED Scout works perfectly well with other Omicron products, for example, Test Universe. The copy and paste function allows you to use the Goose configuration module to subscribe or simulate Gooses with the CMC test set. IED Scout supports Edition 1 and Edition 2 of the standard, as well as data models for hydro, wind, and distributed energy resources.